Attention comedy musicians and comedy music fans, the Logan Awards are taking open nominations for outstanding comedy songs and videos released last year for this year's awards. Did you release a comedy song or music video in 2022, or have a favorite comedy song or video that was released then? Then nominated for the Logan Awards today. The Logan Awards are essentially the Comedy Music Awards, sponsored annually by the Funny Music Project and are presented in three categories. Outstanding Original Comedy Song, Outstanding Parody Song, and Outstanding Comedy Music Video. If you have a comedy song that was released in 2022 that you'd like to nominate for 2023's awards, head to loganawards.com and click the nominations tab at the top. There is a minimum and maximum of five nominations per person. Hurry, nominations close this year on June 30th. For more details about Logan himself, the awards, and more, check out loganawards.com. Help us commemorate the year's best comedy songs and music videos with a trophy, the way they do with every other form of entertainment. But if you want your favorites to win, you have to nominate them by June 30th. Get your nominations in now at loganawards.com, brought to you by thefump.com. Greetings, Internet, and welcome to another episode of A Comedy Musician Reacts. My name is Insane e and I am a comedy musician and comedy music fan, and on this show I react to comedy music from the perspective of a comedy musician, because that's who I am, and that's what I do, and that's what this is, and that's why you're here, and that is the meaning of life. Comedy music. Maybe not. Anyway, if you're new here, yes, I am a comedy musician, and I react to comedy music from the perspective of somebody who they themselves does comedy music. What that means to you is that I will be pausing the video kind of often. Uh, usually that's so that I'm not talking over and missing the jokes, but also that means that I'm going to be discussing things that are going on in the video, be it uh, explaining the jokes, which, you know, everybody loves, or talking about how the song works with the video, how the visuals help enhance the lyrics, because comedy music is all about the lyrics, uh, sometimes uh, how well the jokes are constructed, and sometimes I'm just sitting back and laughing at it. It's a crapshoot, whatever you're going to get, but I think it's a good time either way. If you do enjoy that sort of thing, please like, share, comment, subscribe, do all the things to feed the algorithm to get more eyeballs onto these videos. And if you really want to help the channel out, consider supporting me on Patreon, where patrons get to see my reactions early, exclusive reactions, get, of course, my music and comedy early as well, and all sorts of other cool things like that. Anyway, all of that out of the way. Ooh. Felt a little burp come up there, sorry. Uh, all of that out of the way, let us dive into today's video. Today's song is 11 years old, probably one of the oldest songs I've done on this show. Uh, I regret to say, as being a mythical beast myself, uh, being a big fan of Good Mythical Morning, uh, we're still good. I've not reacted to any songs by Rhett and Link. I admit that I have come into the fandom of being a mythical beast rather late. It was kind of almost after they stopped doing comedy music. They do songs now occasionally. They just did one when I recorded this. They, they just did one this, this past weekend in their 1984 video. Uh, but uh, I knew of Red and Link doing music because in 2013 and in 2015 they were nominated for the Logan Awards, which are the Logan Whitehurst Memorial Awards for Excellence in Comedy Music. Uh, there may even be a promo for that before this video, if I manage to get one in time. Uh, but basically, I'm the chairperson of the Logan Awards. They're the Comedy Music Awards. And before I was the chairperson, in 2013, they were nominated for Rub Some Bacon On It. And in 2015, they were nominated and won for I'm On Vacation. But those were the only two songs of theirs that I knew. Now, I've seen one or two uh, comedy songs by them since then, especially since watching uh, Buddy System, their YouTube Red show, but I not really dived in too much to their songs. Until now. Uh, they just released an updated version of the My Hair song. We're not reacting to the updated version, we're reacting to the original version from 2012. Uh, mostly because I've never heard it, and also because the music video for the new version is a mythical, so mythical Society exclusive. Try saying that three times fast. It's a Mythical Society exclusive, and therefore I, I can't post that on YouTube. Maybe I'll do that on Patreon. Maybe. I am part of the Mythical Society, but, you know, I don't want to, like, cross any rules about doing reactions to content that they've not really released outside of the Society. Might not do that. Might. Well, we don't know. We'll see how this one goes. But, regardless, I've not seen much by Rhett and Link as far as their comedy music videos, so I'm excited to see this. 
I'm excited to get the new version on vinyl. I'm excited to check out the new version after this, but I want to see the original first. I've blabbed enough, probably too much for your liking, I'm sure, so let's finally dive in. I like that the bird was on a string, no wings out, just just a burb ball, and you bat it away, and it swings away. It's it's just a funny effect to me. That's funny. <laughs> sure, he's kind to the birds. My hair goes up. My hair goes down. My hair goes up. My hair goes down. My hair goes up. My hair. It's simple, and obviously things have changed for them, where Rhett's hair goes down because he's letting it grow long, and Link's hair just keeps rising up and up and up as his bouffant gets bigger, his pompadour gets pompadourier. As a man whose hair does not listen to the law of gravity, I relate to that. Um, and of course, what's really even cool, just sonically, about this already, again, I know, we're early. I'm pausing already and discussing. Rhett is singing up. He's, my hair goes up, and Link's hitting the low register. My hair goes down, and they just keep going up higher and lower, each one depending on what their hair does. Obviously, I think in the new version, they're going to switch that, because that's what their hair does now. That's why they updated it. I'm explaining things. See? Explaining jokes is fun. No, I understand that some of you have a problem with that. Whatever. It, it's a thing. My hair flows like a waterfall over a cliff. That is my face. <laughs> my hair goes heaven bound. Dirty blonde rockets into space. Dirty blonde rockets into space. I'm going to have to remember that the next time my hair gets a little too planetoidy. I mean, you're already six foot nine, Rhett, that you're already a giant. As someone who is only four foot twenty, everybody's taller than me. Some of you people know math. Well I could shake my hair and generate enough breeze to locomotive toy sale. <laughs> I, I think that's actually their kids. <laughs> I would need no broom to sweep this room if someone spilled honey bunches of oats cause my hair goes up my I love the idea of of rhyming boat with honey bunches of oats and that's this that's another beautiful thing about comedy music you can get away with dumb rhymes like that it's a dumb rhyme but in a comedy song, it makes it work because it's supposed to be funny. It's supposed to be ridiculous. It's supposed to be bordering on that cleverness of the rhyme, but leading into it's believable in the song because it's supposed to be funny. I absolutely love that. Yeah, power of boat, honey bunches of oats. Just, yeah, man, brilliant. Sweep this room if someone spilled honey bunches of oats. Cause my hair goes up, my hair goes down. Question himself. Again, hashtag relatable. It's I got a haircut recently, but you can see in my previous videos, this I after a while I look like Marge Simpson on crack. It's not a good look, but the it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and higher. Except for the back of my head. The back of my head just I can't grow it long it's because it just turns into a mullet. Because between the Jufro and the mullet, I'm just the hairstyle of New Jersey after a while. I have to cut it short because it doesn't do anything otherwise. It just, foomp. I look, I look like you put a poodle in the dryer. Foomp. It's just not a good look. So I relate to this. 
I, I don't relate to the new hair, Red. I, my wife is convinced me and Red are related because we have the same affinity for food and sometimes the same hair problems. But I'm short, and he's not. I'm going to get back to the song. My hair looks rustic, <laughs> like I've drank my head with a beaver pelt. Mm, my mama <laughs> there laid some eggs up there. I didn't mind that much. She'd raise them in my quaff till the birdies flew off. And we still keep in touch. She raised them in my quaff till the birdies flew off. And we still keep in touch. That's a great lyric. I had... Uh, the vice principal of my high school referred to my hair as a quaff in high school. Uh, my mom would endlessly laugh at that. When are you going to get your quaff cut? My mom just laughed her face off. Yeah. I bet you didn't see my switchblade or my iPad or my chai tea and with a... <laughs> Again, brilliant comedy of, of hiding, listing things. Listing things in comedy songs are great because you can just list the most weird things, the weirdest combination of things. Uh, and it's always going to be funny, and comedy is always great in threes. Number one, Switchblade. Who let Link have a blade? Who let him have a knife? That's not... Don't do that. He dropped it immediately. Thank God. An iPad pulling out of, of your hair. Again, my hair gets so big, I relate to this. I've lost ideas up there, uh, and, but but following it with a with a chai tea. iPad is already huge, so you're hiding that in your hair. That's confusing. But a, it's not just chai tea. It's a cup of chai tea, meaning that somehow he didn't spill it in his hair. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. A little more growth. You won't even know I got a full size baby. Full size baby. <laughs> I would call her Richard, but I'm probably being picky and why you had a kid anyway. <laughs> you think it's gonna be a bridge, but it's like, why why are you hiding a kid anyway? Also, the repeated birds on strings is hilarious. His dad's not named Ricky. Just uh it's good stuff. Well it's actually just a robotic baby. What were we talking about? Your hair goes up, your hair goes down. Your hair goes No, they switched it. Your hair goes in a They switched they switched the uh sing this the which parts of the the melody they're singing because they're singing you. So since he was singing since Link was singing about Red's hair going up, his voice went up. And Brett was singing about Link's voice going his hair going down, so he's, his voice went down. Explaining things that are obvious is a thing I do apparently. Your hair goes up, your hair goes down. Your hair goes up, your hair goes. We interrupt the course of the song to bring you an important message. There are many weighty decisions you must make in life. Like who you're gonna marry, what you're gonna do for them. Boxes of briefs, all commando. And listen, you're gonna make mistakes. <laughs> you might invest your life savings in dehydrated water. You might forget whether prohibited means you can do it or you can't do it. You dehydrated water? Water is... It hurts my head. Not, water doesn't hurt my head. Lack of water hurts my head. I've been dehydrated a lot. Uh, but dehydrated water, hydrogen in what hydrogen, water is hydrated, what I... Oh no, I've gone cross-eyed. Okay, uh, we're moving on. You might ask about pregnant woman if she's pregnant. That's okay, you'll recover. But just make sure you get this one most important course of your life altering choice. I like how he puts the head back on the baby and in the next shot it's the real baby again. Right, 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 right. right. I have my baby back now. <laughs> <laughs> they look the same, you know, hairstyle wise. Does your hair go up? Or does it go down? <laughs> That's 
that's genius. Again, the the whole comparison of up and down, and the rockets going up, and the waterfall going down, and then the end shot, Rhett's the rocket, and Link's swimming down the, the waterfall. It's genius. That's Thanks great stuff. Thanks for watching and subscribing. You can download the song on iTunes. The link is in the description. Click here to watch the behind the scenes video and click here to watch all our music videos. Remember when, when music videos on YouTube used to say, click here for this and click here for this, and sometimes they do that, but like, now because they have the overlays uh, of the videos, you can't see them playing behind them, so they don't have them playing like that. Ninja Sex Party does that a lot too, where you see a lot of the, Here's all these videos. Click one of these and yeah. Video. Leave a comment and let us know. Are you team hair up or team hair down? They're enjoying their fake birds. <laughs> On string. I have I think I think I actually have seen the the t-shirts and the pillows videos too. The songs that go along with those now that I'm now that I'm thinking about it and seeing those in the music video button down there. Uh, that was great. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I sure did. Uh, if you did, please, you know, like, share, comment, subscribe, do all the things to feed the algorithm to get more eyeballs onto these videos. And if you really want to help my, my channel out, consider supporting me on Patreon, where patrons get to see these videos early, get my music early, get your name in the credits like these folks here, and all sorts of other cool stuff like that. Of course, the original video is in the description below. Anyway, we'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye. No, we can't even Shit. He's complete.